Hey, what is up, you guys? It's your boy Insanian. Welcome back to this brand new reaction video. So we're back with something different, guys. I like doing different stuff and uh, things outside of my content. That's you know also to expand myself, uh, being more knowledgeable about different culture and stuff. This is from Thailand. Um, I looked up the uh, name but I forgot it already so you guys just guide me with more info because I love getting my info from you guys in the comment section and if you guys have other more any recommendations and you know where to go my Instagram link in my description insanian underscore why am I asked because if your boy does not look at his comments you can just hit me up there on my DMs fill the applications there and like I always tell you guys the more people tell me react to this the more like let your boy will um, yeah, I got my subtitles on with this one. It's five minutes length, so buckle up. Sitting at 43 million views, was released one month ago, and has got 361k likes. Plus, it's by the channel Surge Music Official. The channel is sitting at 4.91 million subscribers, and this video's got 13k comments. I got myself some thicker drink, guys, some coffee. And uh, if I like Thai stuff, you know, uh, I could also just react to more music from them. Because it's honest, it could be really interesting. Uh, first time gentleman, authentic, like I said. And uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for listening. And for 160k subs, you guys are smashing it. And without further ado, let's get right into this. Uh, yeah, let's check it out. I'm really curious about this. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa! Is that a real dead body or is it fake? They said death kills you once, love kills you time by time. That's really deep. Oh, 
กำลังวาดกลัวเอียงย่านต้องใช้ชีวิตลำพังฝืนอยู่ต่อไปโดยบ่มีเจ้าย่านต้องกลายเป็นคนถูกลืมกลัวนานตาซึ้งไปจนนิ้วแรงแลกชีวิตคงบ่สำคัญทำไมสิยืมเจ้าวาโอ้ยไม่กอดอ yeah, that broke me <laughs> that broke me oh my god oh my god oh my god before I'll share my thoughts I'm gonna drink my coffee first to get some peace then look at the comments then share my thoughts okay See, there's oh, there's no translation, of course. Shit! Now you guys have to translate it. Wow! It wasn't only the lyrics that uh, made it so special. It's the scenery, the visuals that made this really special. Um, before I get into the lyrics, I want to talk about the most important part: the visuals in this case. Because holy shit! Some things I find questionable. At the end, that was the last, like the last drip of water for me to unleash my tears. I'll trade my life for yours if it can hold you back. That caught me. <sighs> Then they burn the casket, which I think it could be a, tra uh, a Thai tra tradition. Because I've never really seen people do that. I mean, I've seen, not seen it, but I know that people, you know, uh, cremate. I don't know the English word, but you know, burn a body and turn it into ashes. But also in a casket. Never seen it that way. Um, wonder if this is a real occurrence because that body looked pretty authentic to me. This also, but love keeps killing you again and again. Some things I think this is deeper than you think it is, and that I I can grasp it. I'm only interpreting stuff. That's why I would like you guys to inform me as well, like I mentioned, because I see him in a casket while his father died. That middle part saying that enjoy the moment. <sighs> You're not realizing it, and after it, it just hits. It just hits. View every day as a bonus. Enjoy your life. Even if you feel like shit on a day, get the most out of it, um, which is a great message. And he said, I'm, "I'm I may not be here, right? Tomorrow is not a guarantee," which is definitely true, right? Life is unexpected. Now we can have a whole philosophic conversation on this, but I'm trying to uh, to see some insight for this MV, uh, which was beautiful. The song itself was actually quite peaceful. It felt a little intense, but yet again came back to peace. Like there's not, all right. 
intense in the sense of overwhelming emotion, uh, sadness, depressed, but not in a not in a dark sense, but in a peaceful sense, if you get what I'm saying. Um, so I just saw two main characters, I guess, and the father died, so maybe this is like the father of the father. I'm not quite sure, guys, so um, you guys inform me. The message got me. Um, I mean, like, if you just watch this as a whole, how, how can you not cry? How can you not cry? Coldness consumes my heart. I know people who are feeling so goddamn depressed and they can't get themselves to be motivated enough to do something on a daily basis to be productive. Because once you are so depressed, once your emotions turn cold, your energy levels plateau in a way that you just stare at yourself as if you're basically emotionless, spacing out, massive brain fog, just feel like shit and you want to get out of that position, right? Which comes not even with grieving, just things that you have to be aware of and uh, it's Suicide Awareness Month for men, so hopefully people uh, will be more of more aware of uh, their surroundings and situations. Afraid of being alone without you also was a line that really fucking called me. It's honestly intense. If you look back at it, I'm 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 trying to hold myself back. He was he was he laid like okay, so he had a portrait of his father and tears were shedding, so if you can Re not really, but if you can put your you in his shoes, how would you feel about that? Fucking sucks. And then he tries to just throw the water because he doesn't want to watch his beloved person die, right? There was also a woman and she faded into obscurity and I'm not quite sure what that was about, so like I said, there's a lot of layers to this. Very deep song, with very deep visuals, double entendres perhaps, and different meanings that I would, lo I would love to look back at and grasp and understand. Um, but this is a very good song. Uh, one that I can definitely listen to again. And uh, also kind of feel stoic, because you know that living in a situation like this, is horrible, but the words that were spoken saying that you should live life is a great advice and uh, makes you want to move forward and maybe rethink some stuff. So it could also be educational in a sense. I'm, I don't mean to drag this too far off, but this was great. I'm actually happy that I saw this, right? Though my mood, of course, isn't the best, <laughs> obviously. Still amazing, and uh, yeah, I hope that you guys enjoyed this reaction video. If you guys did, so please make sure to give it a thumbs up. If you guys like me and my content, please subscribe. Become an insane today. Because your boy does post consistently. Here's another video for you guys to check out. Rest in peace, and I'll be Etika. Trucker boys forever. Because your day, I'm an opposite of you. It's bye.